This is Gold Class. He's my first of my five to follow for the summer. He's a horse who won well at market raising. He got a six pound rise in the weights, but I think he's well capable of winning off his mark again. He's a horse who's got a nice mark on the flat as well, and I'm sure he'll win on the flat also. This is a horse called Banff. He was second at market raising on his first run for me. I was actually a little bit disappointed when he got beat. Uh, a stable, stable mate his gold class beat him. I think it was a lack of experience and, uh, and, and, and race course experience that got him beat. Um, he's a horse that I think will take a lot of beating the next day off his mark. The handicapper didn't move him, and, uh, and I'd like to think he's better than a, than a horse rate 100. He's a horse who probably wants to step up and trip from two miles, but wherever he goes the next day, I think he'll go very close. He will, I'd say, handle soft ground well. Um, he's a horse I probably ran over the wrong trip the last day and uh, an experience caught him out. So, no, he's a horse I think is going to win plenty of races. This horse called Hong Kong Adventure. He had three runs in maiden hurdles and probably doesn't handle soft ground very well. I'm looking forward to running him in a handicap. He's a horse who goes well at home and he's a horse who's going to be ready to run the next 10 days time. Yeah, this is Dove Mountain. He was also my first winner. Um, he's only a fun little handicapper, but it's obviously a horse that will he, have a place in my heart for a long time. He's gone up the weights, but he's uh, certainly a horse I think may win again off his mark during the summer. This horse called Sky of Stars. He won at Stratford on Sunday before he was second at Utox for me for, on, on his first run. He's a horse who's going to go up in the handicap after winning the last day. I think he's well capable of, uh, of winning off his new mark once he's been reassessed.